The area of science that our lab works in is essentially neurodegeneration. We're trying to treat diseases of the aging brain. Our lab really focuses on motor neuron disease, where the neurons or nerve cells that are in the brain and spinal cord die over time, and we don't know why they die, but as they die, people become paralyzed and weak, and eventually they will die within two to three years. We have a research program that works with people living with motor neuron disease so that we can understand why people are different. We take the knowledge that we learn from people in that face-to-face -face patient setting into the lab where we use laboratory models, including stem cells that we turn into neurons to really understand what might be driving the death of these neurons in different people over the course of their disease. And the first big vision that we really have is a world free from MND, so that no one has to receive this diagnosis that there is no cure for a disease. But really the second thing in the lab is to really generate the next wave of leaders in Australian research who can take what we do here at UQ even further, make it their own and maybe treat other neurodegenerative diseases like Huntington's disease or Parkinson's disease. The key project that our lab works on is really trying to understand how the body in someone with MND uses energy, how it sort of absorbs its energy from the nutrients that it consumes, and how the cells generate energy to function and survive. What we've found is that in people with MND, sometimes the nerve cells don't actually use their primary energy source, which is sugar, and they start using fats instead, which even though fat is a really good energy source, um, eventually over time when you use too much fat, it becomes toxic in itself and it's likely going to kill the cells. So our lab really focuses on how this balance between the use of sugar and fat can be tweaked to improve the way that the cells function so that they can survive for longer. And it's really um, exciting for us because the work that we've done in the lab has already transitioned into clinical trials and we're running a trial now for people with motor neuron disease. In terms of working with industry, our team work with a lot of pharmaceutical companies in validating some of the work that they've done with drugs that they've shown might have some benefit in motor neuron disease. And they come to us knowing that we have really deep knowledge about the disease and that we have the know-how in how to sort of drive these experiments in the lab forward to get ideal results. And so I think working with industry is really important because they may have a vision for their drugs or their compounds and they can come to us and we can help them, I guess, work on the design of projects to then bring that to fruition, get drugs into the clinic faster for everyone who's living with neurodegeneration.